क्लास सिक्स सब्जेक्ट सोशल स्टडीज हिस्ट्री चैप्टर थ्री इन द अर्लीस्ट सिटीज क्यू वन हाउ ओल्ड आर द हरप्पन सिटीज आंसर हरप्पन सिटीज वर डिवेलप्ड अबाउट फोर थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड ईयर्स अगो क्यू टू वॉट वर द ऑब्जेक्ट्स इन हरप्पन सिटीज मेड ऑफ आंसर Objects in Harappan cities made of out of stone, shell, and metal. Q3. List some uses of irons. A rings and tiny vessels. Answer. Irons was used to make beads, bangles, a rings, and tiny vessels. Q4. Where fire altars have been discovered. Answer. Fire altars have been discovered in Kalibangan and Lothal. Q5. Which two metals form the alloy bronze? Answer. Tin and copper forms the alloy bronze. Q6. When and where cotton cultivation has started? Answer. Cotton cultivation started at Mehargan about 7000 years ago. Q7 Make a list of what the Harappans ate Answer Wheat barley pulses peas rice sesame linseed mustard and fruits Q8 Name the terracotta toys have been found during excavations Answer Toy cart and toy plow Q9 How were bricks arranged to build walls in Harappan cities? Answer: The bricks were laid in an interlocking pattern, and that made the walls strong. Q10: Why was plow used? Answer: The plow was used to dig the earth for turning the soil and planting seeds. Q11: Name the cities which had elaborate storehouses. Answer: Some cities like Mohenjo-daro, Harappa, and Lothal had elaborate storehouses. Q12: Who is a specialist? Answer: A specialist is a person who is trained to do only one kind of work, for example, cutting stone or polishing beads or carving seals. Q13: What were the seals used for? Answer Seals may have been used to stamp bags or packets containing goods that were sent from one place to another Q14 What do you understand by raw material Answer Raw materials are substances that are either found naturally such as wood or ores of metals or produced by farmers or herders Q15 Discuss the term citadel. Answer: Many of these cities were divided into two or more parts. Usually, the part to the west was smaller but higher. Archaeologists describe this as the citadel. Q16. What was special about Great Bath of Mohenjo-daro? Answer: Great Bath. In Mohenjo-daro, a very special tank. which archaeologists call the great bath was built in this area this was lined with bricks coated with plaster and made watertight with a layer of natural tar there were steps leading down to it from two sides while there were rooms on all sides water was brought in from a well and drained out after use important people took a dip in this tank on special occasion q17 Explain the term ceiling. Answer: After a bag was closed or tied, a layer of wet clay was applied on the knot and the seal was pressed on it. The impression of the seal is known as a ceiling. Q18. How Dholavira was different from Harappan cities? Answer: Unlike some of the other Harappan cities which were divided into two parts, Dholavira was divided into three parts and each part was surrounded with massive stone walls with entrances through gateways Q19 
Issue 19. How do archaeologists know that cloth was used in Harappan civilization? Answer. Actual pieces of cloth were found attached to the lid of a silver vase and some copper objects at Mohenjo-Daro. Archaeologists have also found spindle whorls made of terracotta and fines. These were used to spin thread. Q20. Discuss the farming methods of the Harappans. Answer. Plow was used to dig the earth for turning the soil and planting seeds. As this region does not receive heavy rainfall, some form of irrigation may have been used. This means that water was stored and supplied to the fields when the plants were growing. Q21 What were the three major categories of people in Harappan cities? Answer The different categories of people lived in Harappan cities were there were people who planned the construction of special buildings in the city. These were the rulers. There were scribes, people who knew how to write, who helped prepare the seals, and wrote on other materials that have not survived. There were men and women, craftspersons, making all kinds of things, either in their own homes, or in special workshops. Q22 what were the reasons for the end of Harappan civilization? Answer. Following could be the reasons for the end of Harappan civilization. Some scholars suggest that the rivers dried up. Others suggest that there was deforestation. This could have happened because fuel was needed for baking bricks and for smelting copper ores. Besides, grazing by large herds of cattle, Sheep and goat may have destroyed the green cover. In some areas there were floods. Q23. Explain why metals, writing, wheel and plough were considered important for the Harappans? Answer. Metals, writing, the wheel and the plough were important for the Harappans in many ways. Metals were used for making various tools, utensils, jewellery and seals. Writing was useful for maintaining the records related to trade and for various other purposes. Wheel was used in carts to ferry people and goods. Wheel was also used as potter's wheel. Plow was used for tilling the land so that farming could be done. Q24 Write about the houses, drains and streets of Harappan cities. Answer Houses, drains and streets of Harappan cities. Generally, houses were either one or two stories high, with rooms built around a courtyard. Most houses had a separate bathing area, and some had wells to supply water. Many of these cities had covered drains. Each drain had a gentle slope so that water could flow through it. Drains in houses were connected to those on the streets and smaller drains led into bigger ones. As the drains were covered, inspection holes were provided at intervals to clean them.